Hello everyone, it's Daniel here. Well, it's a bright and hot and sunny day here in Southern Virginia. And I made a video about a month ago about uh, the same spot. And I had a scintillation detector, Lutla Model 19. And I was just showing uh, some of the ground radiation here. Uh, it's a uranium deposit I'm standing in right now and it comes to the surface right along this uh, road here and that uh, simulation detector had a sodium iodide crystal in it and I said I was gonna get a model 3 next and look what we have here and I have the pancake probe which uh, it came with it uh, off eBay but I uh, went ahead and got one of these it's a 3 inch by 3 inch scintillation detector right here and it's a, it's a plastic one, so it's not as sensitive as a, a sodium iodide one, but the large size makes it uh, really good. And uh, it's pretty rugged too. Pleased with it. So, while we're here, I figured I'd turn it on and see what kind of background reading we get. Uh, the house, which is a couple miles from here, about a mile and a half, it's about 3,000 counts per minute, which is normal for... Uh, mostly everywhere around here it's at uh, 900 volts is the, that's what the detectors at so let's see what we can get here at background let me turn it on here all right it's maxed out on the lowest and the second to lowest decade scale so let's go on up to the times 10 scale come on over here away from all this stuff all right let's see what we're at it's really bright. Let me see if I can. All right, it's right at about uh, a little bit under 1,000. So it's so let's just say 800 times 10. So it's about 8,000 counts per minute is the background here. So that's a little bit of, uh, more than twice the normal background reading in most places. And anywhere along this ditch, I will probably get a great. A, a bigger reading but some places are higher than others all right right here it's about the same thing that exactly the same thing so let's go on down a little ways and it should we should start we start getting into it all right right there i don't know if you can see it it's uh, above the 1000 mark so it's, it's the right it's at about 1400 that's about 14,000 counts per counts per minute. It's on the time 10 scale still. And you can uh, actually hear it just standing in the road right here is uh, just about as high as what we were up there. So we should get a pretty high reading right here in the ditch. Let's put it down here. All right, uh, grass is in my way. All right, now we're getting up to about 1,800 times 10 so it's still about the same thing about 18,000 all right now I can tell it's increasing quite a bit here and we are at almost 5,000 times 10 that's 50,000 counts per minute quite a big difference than up there it's about six times background in this area and if you want to say normal background and uh well it's about six times background in this vicinity for normal background in this part of the country you can just say it's about uh, uh 15 20 between 15 and 20 times background let's see if we can get any higher readings through here i'm not it's so thick in the winter i can mark a See, just right there, that's about three feet from where we just were, and it's only at about 20,000 counts per minute. Let's we'll take about three steps down here, two steps down here, and we are uh, hard to do this with one hand. And we are at oh, 55,000, almost 60, let's just say 60,000. It's so much better during the winter.
Yeah, I hit 60 there for a minute. There we go. That's right a little bit above 60. So say 62,000 count, 64,000 count per minute. And that's probably about the... This is the first time I've used it here. So that must be... That's probably around the maximum I will get. I have some, uh... Some other items at the house I might make a videos of. I've tested right when I got it and I was actually a piece of Thorite. I was maxing out the highest decade scale. So that would be over 650,000 counts per minute with the small piece of Thorite. Uh, about the size, twice the size of one of these pieces of gravel. And let's go on down a little bit just to see what we get down here. And you can tell by the clicks that we've been down quite a bit. And we are at we're still in the times 10 scale, so we are about 800 uh, on the meter, so times 10 is 8,000. So we're back at what we had up there. So this is about, I don't know, about 100 feet or so. About 50 feet out there, it's just say 60,000 counts per minute. And so it's about seven, might as well just say seven times what we were right here and I would check out some other places through here but it's pretty thick I'll wait till the winter and make some more videos with this with this type of detector but yeah I'm, I'm very pleased with this uh, detector I'll show you a close-up of it a little bit more uh, this one has a, a BNC connector so I had to uh, get an adapter for it which were kind of costly I turned this off but uh and i'll use uh i could use the pancake pro but it's not uh nearly as sensitive as this so it will it'll be kind of boring after this this fella went all right and uh i'll make some more videos pretty soon with this guy so uh until next time